click on the subscribe button and don't forget to press the bell icon to get the latest update from this channel. Hello friends, today I am going to show you how you can keep your jailbreak permanent in your iDevice. This method also works on all iOS, either it's uh, 12, 13 or 14, no problem. As you can see, this is my iPhone 8 and its version is 13.2.2. Uh, but I already checked this one on 14.3, the latest iOS. It works really good. So, first of all, uh, you jailbreak your iDevice. It's either from CheckRain or you can jailbreak it from Uncover. First of all, open CDA and upgrade all. Confirm from here. Upgrade all all essentials and uh, wait for update. It will uh, update and uh, respring. So wait. It's going to update. Now restart to respring and open CD again. Now we need to add uh, one repo and uh, here you can add repo as you can see I already put it on the screen you can find it there. add repo it will take some time it depends on your internet also this method also work on all iPhones either you are a, you have iPhone 6 or iPhone 7 iPhone 8 till it works very pretty now return to CDA as you can see that the repo is already added and all packages are there so let's we find for safe shutdown as you can see there is yeah here are two safe shutdowns one is the paid one and the second one is the Chinese one we need to download this one the Chinese one okay so click on it and install it now confirm wait for some time so this will save your CDA after restart you can shut down your uh, iPhone and uh, it will keep your uh, CDA to there you don't worry about that because when we jailbreak any device after restart it will go so this method for that if you want to save your CDA permanently there restart springboard now let's see here is the icon for save shutdown we open it and see there is lot of uh, options So we go to settings and uh, where it is here. Here is the safe shutdown. Open it. First of all, turn off tweak enabled. Now from here, hold lock instead. Turn off, turn on it. Now power down menu. 
and here is all options are enabled disable all only you left save shutdown on okay now turn on to be enabled respring your i device and that's all you are all done now we turn off our iphone let's see you can see here is return safe shutdown now we can shut down safely no problem now i turn on i device as you can see there is and that's it you can see our cd is there our check rain is there you can uh, apply it on all ios and uh, all iphones no problem it doesn't matter it's iphone 6 or 7 each and everything work as you can see here thank you for watching see you next time till then bye bye